thank you for the extra time and i realize that many of these issues have been discussed here before you but and we talked tonight about not cheering and, and I understand that and not and not having behavior. I will tell you there have been times where we've been up here and felt that same response. And so it is it is difficult when you are uh, cut off from those situations because what we're really asking for is for the city of Naperville, the residents to be able to make an informed decision. I read an article about why you want to revisit that referendum because it's you've talked to people on the street that say they wish they could go back on that. And I know that you've said that people you talk to are in favor of the smart grid and the smart meters. Everyone I've talked to either doesn't know about it or is opposed to it for one of the four reasons brought up here. And so all we're asking is that this not be driven by West Monroe Partners, by the de uh, Department of Energy grant, but by the residents of Naperville, the people that it most affects over time. In the end, the savings is $30 million over 15 years Potentially, in today's dollars, that equates to about a latte a month. And I'll tell you, I, I will, I, I, that to me, if that's all the savings I, as the taxpayer, am going to receive, then I would like you to do the courageous thing and pause and look into it. I hear the timer going. Thank you, Mr. Thank Senator. you.